Well, uh, here's as good a place to start as any. Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back for more La Milana 2. Uh, in the last episode, we explored a bit of the ancient malice, but we didn't get a whole lot done, honestly speaking. But that's going to change a little bit, because uh, I figured out how we can get down here. If you use the knife, there is a piece of land here you can uh, attack without getting struck by lightning. So we're going to drop down and, uh... Ooh, that was dangerous. Good thing we got so much HP, right? Ooh! Um, speaking of dying, that was not right. Oh well. That's fine. I did not lose a lot of progress. We can just teleport right on back. Or at least within a reasonable distance of it. Oops. Again, I'm having a slight control issues here, although I don't know if it's the controller or the game. Yeah, like before, uh, avoid attacking the Anunnaki emblems if you can... Ow, help it. These... These monsters are rather annoying. There. What is this? The Anunnaki Stone Hut. Whoa, hi. What's this say? The Sky People of the Anunnaki arrived on Nibiru. They arrived in a land where people could not live. Among pure chaos where neither air nor water existed. What? So what's the deal with this, uh, this hot spring here? Okay. A few more shots into the chamber. Uh, not really sure how significant that is. Alright, so maybe this was nothing after all. But as long as we are here at the Ancient Chaos... Uh, Oh, get out. This place is going to get me killed. Kind of already has a couple times, hasn't it? Ow. Yes, fall to all your deaths. Alright, let's see here. Ow. That didn't help me very much. There. Suppose I were to jump up this way, that doesn't help me at all, actually. Yeah. Ugh. 
I don't think I actually know enough to, uh... Well, I guess there's one thing I can try before I get on out of here. And that would be try a couple of... oops. A couple of different items. What if I use the crystal skull? No. No? No. Alright, I don't know. Guys, I found something invisible. What's this have to say? Hermes! The third children, the Olympians, and then shut away. Huh. Okay. I'll tell you what you need to know about this place. The third children's underworld deity is known as Hades. It's already been driven out by the underworld deity of another generation of children. He was once a hero. You are the hero who uh, saved the first child twins uh, that we learned about in the first game. Hmm. That's so. Uh... Water flows from the eye of chaos. It looks upon the conflict between angels and demons and weeps at the disparity of power. Could it be talking about the Olympians and the Gigas? And now you're just repeating yourself. Alright, what's through here? Anything? This is Skilla's room. I can drop through here. Ooh, what's this? The twin vessel. Weren't we told something about that a long time ago? I don't even remember. A vase that stocks the power of storms, stored in the buried fortress. Buried fortress and vase for the power of storms. Hmm. There's a vase-shaped hollow in the altar. Okay. Oops! Uh, yeah, don't do that. <laughs> I, uh... Oh, I can get out. Okay. Oop. Skilla. Okay. Okay, I guess I can't get out. Not without doing something magical. Uh, alright, back to the treetop we go. Let's try again, this time going up. Because the whole reason I was up there was to, uh, to investigate a clue that I had about the uh, celestial disk. And it responding to the word that represents heaven. I want to try something about that. Whew. Yep, that didn't work. Nope. Well, now it's too late to do anything. Yeah. Gotta wait for the platform. Down we go. Ellie Vigar. Don't know if that is a significant room to anybody or not. 
Yeah, we not we wanna keep being up here. Ooh, hello. What's all this? It's a uh, it's a chakra, but that doesn't mean a whole lot to us. Climb up. Uh, war mural. That's not where we want to be. I think we want to be up in this room. Typhons. No. Okay. I was wrong. Computer created by the third children. Okay. And that doesn't tell me much of anything, which means I'm all out of leads again. Actually, no, I'm not. You can just not drop down. <laughs> Monster Jaw. Ooh, hello. Uh, let's wait to see what this giant stone slab does before we uh, go about judging its intentions. Alright, it moves back and forth. Um, I'm going to want to stick around a while, I think. Hearing. Am I hearing the, the pillar from the next room over? It's possible. What's all this about? If I put a weight here, what happens? That happens. What does that do for me? Well, it puts a bunch of skeletons in my way. But I can't get up because they don't have the feather, so I guess I'm going back. Like so. What's in this room? Celestial Disc. Alright, we're finally making some progress. The wake of the infernal fiend that lusts for the mother's pet. The infernal fiend bites into the neck of the colossal dragon. Hmm. Well, first of all, let's use our heaven mantra. What does that do for us, though? I'm not sure. One turn leads to the Priestess, three turns leads to the Griffin. Something like that, anyway. Those who turn to Celestial Bodies thrice so shall see Hell. Alright. Is that where we're going? What's all this? What is this? Glossia Lobolus' room. Hmm. Well, since we have the, uh... Since we have the tablet, I feel pretty safe, uh, leaving to heal. And let's go back. Alright, let's check out this uh, Glossio Lobolus. Maybe we can take him out now.
Maybe not. I do want to uh, figure out what changed. I guess starting with, let's go up. Ow. More mural again. Typhon will awaken the two lights. The lights will be cast upon two walls. The light obstructing walls will accept the light, and Typhon shall awaken. I don't quite know what that means yet. Monsters room. There is a, uh, a chest here. Mm, something going on up here. Orpheus. My harp can bring even those of the underworld to tears. I once visited the underworld to see my dead wife. I played her a song of paradise. Alright, we know where we can buy a harp. It's uh, pretty expensive, though. Within the belly of the crawling Infernal Fiend. What is the Infernal Fiend? Is that Typhon? Temple of Chaos. Vapara Yuga, the Age of Copper, when disaster was wrought from virtue and sin in balance. Uh, we've been hearing about the about these Yuga for a while. Oh, hello. If you have no business in this temple, then leave. You were a boss in the original La Mulana. What are you doing here? I do wonder. Come to think of it, there's supposed to be a secret shop somewhere over in this room, isn't there? Eris. Typhon is the enormous machine created by the ancestors of us Olympians. Even while dormant, it continues to seal off the Gigas. The ancient texts record the Typhon can be reawakened under strong light. We did see a light somewhere in this area. That doesn't tell us as much as I want to know, though. Try chanting again. Like so. What does this do for us? There's a weight down, or there's a pedestal down here I can put a weight on. What's this do for us? Oh, okay, this lets us get back down into Typhon's room. Not that I know what the purpose of that is. But we're gonna have to look around a bit more. Aha! Okay, so the rooms within the war mural uh, shift around with the celestial disc. That opened up that, not that uh, I know how to get anywhere. Oh well, we'll figure something out. This room, uh, this room remains the same.
Nothing to do but experiment, right? Yeah. Uh, now there's something facing this way. I don't think that helps us, though. can't get out of here. Well, let's look around. Not much has changed in this room. here now, but that doesn't do anything for us. We can do something about this. One. Oops! <laughs> okay, don't attack the light receptors. Wait for me, okay. Yeah, okay. And two. Cool. Let's find out what, uh, what this machine has to tell us. Mother clone records. Our race, born from chaos, sought the mother's power. From the remains of the woman of the first children, we attempted to draw up the power to create life itself. Inua. Hmm. It's destroyed in the Tower of Rune, for it lacked even the power to move from the pure in space, rendering it useless. That which was created was much larger than those of our race that manifested the power to beget life. Eleven inhuman monsters were born. The entity escaped with its offspring to another dimension by using its dimension-pending powers and claims have been ruined. The final hope to which we have committed all of our power, utilizing the fruit of our previous layers, we used the body of one of our own daughters. As of Tiamat, eleven monsters were born, after which they fell into sleep in their larval forms. We shall wait for these children to awaken. We shall wait for the time when they awaken us. Once again, to unleash their power. We shall rule over Eglana. Okay. So, Nuwa, Tiamat, and Echidna are all Olympian experiments. Mm -hmm. 
Hey Hermes, we turned on your computer. Yeah. Oh, what does this do for me? Proceed down the path where the backs face each other. Uh, I don't know what that means. Still makes me kind of nervous. Still turn on. The, the path where the backs face each other. Oop, that's a sacred orb that we uh, can't get to. Ow. That was painful. What am I supposed to do? Well, I guess it doesn't matter now because I'm dead. Say something about a falling statue. Hmm. Somewhere, anyway. I gotta figure out how to kill this monster. Oops. 
Run! Oh! <laughs> I got faked out! Alright, that's fine. We'll just kill him again. But yeah, okay, the backs are facing each other. Let's, uh, let's see what's on the road up ahead before we, uh, commit to stopping or not stopping. What's all this? The spiral mural. Well, I can push you onto this. that do for us exactly? You know, I'm really not sure. Let's try that again. Like, seriously, what? Cog that turns the great mechanism. The twins protect a beast's jaw. Eh? I see a data ROM. Glossia Lobolus. Oops. Well, you know what? Um... Alright, let's try to solve the mystery of the, uh, the sp Ah. So, hang on a second. If we... Do this and then run. We can make it down. Okay. Okay. I mean, that doesn't uh, help whatever that guy is trying to do with his weight, but. Uh... At least uh, it's clear we we are not perma stock if I screw up the mural. Oops. Yeah. Wait. 
Okay, so both the angels and the demons are facing left on the upper level. Faction facing right. We can get up there now. Is that because I killed one of the four monsters? Oops. Angels facing right. Oops. Come on, I want to get that orb. Sacred Orb, get! And we can get up here now. What is this? Temple of Chaos. The primeval state of existence before the world was created. Does that mean it'll respond to this? Indeed! What's this? What's important is what's inside. Try sitting. Try placing your hand upon it. Get up there. It's trying to tell me. I think I can... 
get up there without the feather. We did stuff. We did stuff, and it's time to uh, call it an episode. <laughs> Progress, finally! Woohoo!